Welcome to our tour blog from Baden Baden. Enjoy. ברוכים הבאים לבלוג טור של הברלינים פילהרמוניקה. Bienvenue sur le blog des Berliner Philharmoniker. Sejam bem-vindos ao nosso blog da nossa turnê. Hi alle sammen, velkommen til vores tour blog. Vi ser frem til at se jer i Baden Baden. Minden gik tæret at der lytvøs lønka turnen kun. Welcome to the tour blog of the Berlin Philharmonic. Ja, herzlich willkommen. Es freut uns, dass ihr oder sie sich für unseren Tourblock interessieren. Ähm, wir freuen uns alle auf Baden-Baden, aber jetzt ist die letzte Probe und ich muss jetzt leider mich vorbereiten gehen. I suppose I'd better be honest about the magic flute. I've spent my life avoiding conducting it. Uh, I conducted the Da Ponte operas an enormous amount, Idomeneo an enormous amount. I have a sense of self-preservation because in fact the pieces are conductor's graveyard and I've heard so many people find it very, very difficult I had an interview the other day with a really very nice journalist. They, they do exist, you know. And she asked me, why are you doing in your new festival such a repertoire piece as The Magic Flute? And I was surprised. I had kind of started up and I thought, oh, is any piece a repertoire piece? And then I thought, you know, there are some pieces which are so brilliantly successful and so popular immediately that people tend to forget how extraordinary, extraordinary they are. In England, we have this with Shakespeare's Midsummer Night's Dream, for instance. People tend to say, oh no, not another production of that. And then whenever you see it, you're completely begeistered, as we say in English. The Schubert Unfinished Symphony is another one of them. I mean, there are and many great works of art that are so familiar. But let's not forget what a raging masterpiece the magic flute is and how different it was from anything anybody had done before, even Mozart. It surprised me, knowing how much opera the orchestra has played, to find out actually that these are the first live performances of the Magic Flute in the history of the orchestra. Uh, recently, actually, the orchestra say they can't remember when they played the Magic Flute overture, since people don't play overtures very much, let alone the rest of the piece. It was recorded in the 30s, the first ever studio recording of the piece by Beecham, and also done in the studio by Carrie Ann, but no performances. So we are privileged to be giving the first Berlin Philharmonic performances of this astonishing, funny, moving, profound piece. <laughs> 